Hey everyone, the Discovery Children's Museum in Las Vegas is a good one. Opened in 2013, it's an amazing space for kids, offering three floors of fun focusing on creativity, exploration, and play. Here's a quick overview of what to expect. On the entrance floor, the first thing you'll see is the Waterworld exhibit and the coolest ball launching water contraption that even had us parents amazed. Inside, there are a few other water activities that will capture the kids' attention, and the floor also has a toddler town and a fantasy festival space for dress-up and imaginative play. The second floor has the Eco City, where the kids can try out all the popular careers and professions that go into making a successful city. This mini city is a busy area, and the girls bounce around, spending most of their time as doctors working on a full-sized operation game or flying us between cities as pilots. The third floor is where the kids can flex their inner creativity in the patents pending area, making Lego box cars or creating parachutes out of coffee supplies before testing their creations at a couple of fun structures. Seeing them work out the problems and retest updated crafts was really great to see. And the floor also has an arts and craft area next door. The summit play structure towering in the middle of the children's museum was most of the kids' favorite activity by far. Stretching 70 feet up from the first floor all the way up to the building's roof, the 12th floor play structure is one of those structures that makes you think, why the heck didn't they have this when I was a kid? Every mini floor has activities with multiple entrances and exits, which makes it super easy to lose a kid in there, but it's extremely fun to traverse. We stayed until close and found a lot of other great off the strip kids activities that you can see here. Happy travels. Thanks for watching our show.